We are analog beings living in a digital world facing a quantum future. Please explain. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, it's a big topic, as you mentioned, but um, I think uh, my starting point in the book is really the unhappiness which is prevalent in our society. Uh, maybe summed up by a comedian, Louis C.K., when he said, uh, everything is amazing right now, but nobody's happy. <laughs> uh, <laughs> and he was talking about the internet on, uh, on airplanes, for example. Um, and I think there is a widespread feeling that the deluge of digital information uh, which is coming at us all uh, and, uh, of course, creating many wonderful things, uh, opportunities to communicate and to educate and so on, uh, is also feels rather alien to us as natural uh, living creatures. And so that phrase uh, summarizes the feeling, first of all, that we really, as human beings, appreciate analog things more than digital. Uh, we like uh, continuous, uh, smooth, uh, pleasant things like art and music and uh, natu the natural world. Um, and as a mathematician or mathematical physicist, it's very obvious that something which is continuous contains far more information that something, than something digital. Mm -hmm. Digital is just means zeros and ones, and there's nothing more brutal than a zero or a one, um, and uh, it's the lowest form of information. So when people talk about the digital re revolution, it always feels to me they're missing the point. Uh, this is, in a sense, bringing us all down to the lowest possible form of information. Um, and, uh, of course, the exciting thing is what's ahead of us is quantum. Uh, quantum computers, quantum information, quantum communication. And I think this message has really not got out there yet, that what is just around the corner are um, computers and electronic devices that will operate in truly quantum ways. Uh, and so there are three levels of information, digital, analog, and quantum. And quantum is really a realm of information above us. It will extend us. It will change us. Uh, and in the book, I speculate about the next form of life being quantum life.